hello everyone and welcome back to my channel in this video is going to be a kitchen transformation and you're going to see how i transform my kitchen from this into this i've been very into the pops of pink lately which is why i wanted to go ahead and use the marble pink paper contact paper i ordered this on amazon and i'll have that link down below you first wanted to start by cleaning your kitchen, like taking off everything and put Windex or whatever kitchen counter thing you use to clean, um, just to make sure you have a clean surface with no dust or anything, and the contact paper will stick a lot better that way. You're also going to need a gift card or a, any type of card. If you, if you have one of those cards that are meant for this project, that works too but i didn't have one so i used a a used gift card i started using my license but that was not a good idea so i switched over to a gift card an old gift card that i found so yeah so then you're going to start by peeling off the the contact paper do it little by little um this is a very tedious task uh, i have basically no patience so if you have no patience you might not even want to do this because i gave up on the patients along the way but um but it's very tedious you have to do it little by little um make sure you pass that gift card around and around again just to make sure there's no bubbles or anything like that and it's very nice and smooth This is the part that really got to me. The edges was the most difficult part for me. This is actually my take two on this project because the first time I completely messed up, I had to take it all off and reorder everything just because I messed up really bad the first time because of the edges. Um, and it's mostly the edges, like the corner edges because it has a different form. So you can't just, you know, fold it and that's it. So you have to like cut around it, cut another piece so you can actually get that form there. Um, as you can see here, I'm cutting around and um, and making that shape for it. So it's again, it's a very tedious task that you just have to have a lot of patience for. And I also pre-cut everything. I pre-measured, pre-cut. That's another lesson I learned from the first time. This is completely a game changer because that way you know where it goes and that it's definitely going to fit before you waste paper for nothing. And this is the final look to the kitchen. I did not record the other part because it's basically the same thing, but I really like the way it turned out despite all the troubles. It gives me just a brand new look to the kitchen it gives me something to look at especially now in quarantine that we're all in now so that's all i like to do just projects around the house i actually have an idea for that little coffee section that i have there so that's gonna be my next video so hit that subscribe button down below again i'll have this paper link down below if you're interested amazon has a whole bunch of them and i will see you next time bye